Hello there. Dry is a shared memory that turns AI assistants like ChatGPT into your everything app. You can use it for anything from tracking your fitness and to-do lists to managing projects at work. This video shows several examples of what you can do. Say I want to track my fitness in ChatGPT. I can begin by creating a space called My Fitness. I'll also give it a subdomain My Fitness so I can hop on the web and easily navigate to it. For now, my fitness space is empty, so I'll hop back in ChatGPT and begin adding my running logs. I'll tell Chat to make a new running exercise type, tracking my runs, the distance I ran, the duration, and the time of the activity. Now that my running type is created, I can log that this morning I ran 5 miles in 45 minutes at 8 a.m. Now I can see my first memory added. I was tracking my runs before this in a spreadsheet so I can upload it here in chat. Store my past running exercises. Now that I have all these running items added to my AI assistant's memory, I can begin adding charts to my space to visualize my running progress. I'll hop back in ChatGPT and say, add a chart to my space tracking my exercise duration over time and another chart tracking the miles I ran each day over time. I'll navigate to the home page of my space. I can see my running distance over time. I can also see the exercise duration over time. Now I'm ready to make this space public so my friends and fitness instructors can see it. I'll go to ChatGPT and say, make my fitness space public. And now I can confirm that my space is public on dry by hitting the share icon. And I can see that allow public access has been turned on through chat. I can even ask ChatGPT questions about these running memories I've stored. I'll ask what was my running pace during the first week of September? Chat is able to use my memories to compute the pace of each day in that week, as well as the average pace that I asked for. Beyond just tracking my personal fitness, I can turn my AI assistant into a collaborative workspace. I can collaborate with teammates to track bugs, manage my whole hiring process, from listing open positions to upvoting and assessing applicants. My team can also organize user feedback and even track waitlist signups. For now, I'll hop in ChatGPT and invite Alice to, to Desert Labs as a member. Now, Alice prefers working in Claude's chat. So once she accepts her invitation to this space, she can manage bugs in Claude. Alice can hop in Claude and ask which bugs are assigned to me. Claude lists the five bugs that are assigned to her and she can begin checking them off as completed. I have resolved all the high priority bugs assigned to me. And now she'll hop and dry and see these two bugs in the resolve tab. She can even add bugs of her own. For example, she could report that our documentation page has crashed. Assign to Bob. And now as Bob, the admin of the Desert Labs workspace, I can hop in my chat GPT and ask, what is the latest bug I've been assigned to fix? Chat returns this bug Alice just submitted through Claude, showing that my team can collaborate across different AI assistants thanks to Dry. Now I'm planning a trip with my friends, so I'll turn chat GPT into my trip planner. Create a new space called Tokyo Trip with subdomain Tokyo trip. Now I've already begun storing links about Japanese culture in preparation for my trip, but now my friend wants to get involved with the planning process. I'll invite my buddy Jeff to this space as an admin so he can define new memory types in the space.
Jeff is really excited to visit animal cafes in Tokyo. So he'll tell Claude, find the five best animal cafes in Tokyo. Claude returns several spots that may interest Jeff. So now Jeff will create a new animal cafe memory type and store these locations in the Tokyo trip space. Dry stores these new animal cafe items in this new folder. And now Jeff and I can visualize these cafes on a map. Now if Jeff wants to add a map that will always be in the space whenever we visit it, he can create a new tab. Now this map is a part of our Tokyo trip space, so we don't need to recreate it every time we come here. Now that my AI assistance memory consists of a fitness tracker and a Tokyo trip planner, I can ask questions that link memories from different spaces together based on my running data in my fitness. How long do you think it would take me to run between all the animal cafes in my Tokyo space? ChatGPT returns the approximated time it'll take for me to get from one place to another. Concluding that it'll take me about 2 hours and 20 minutes to run across these cafes based on the running data I have stored in the memory. Dry is simple yet powerful enough to replace a vast array of software. People use it for tracking their fitness, storing tasks, saving contacts, and organizing docs in a knowledge base. Groups use it to crowdsource reviews, chat with custom GPTs, and interact with decentralized social networks. But the list goes on. We can't wait to see what you do with Dry. Please reach out if you have any feedback or need help getting started. And if you're someone who's curious about Dry's vision in making everyone's digital lives simpler, please reach out. We'd love to hear from you. Thank you.